Right now we are in the Inava district of Lithuania at exercise Iron Wolf, one of Lithuania's largest annual military exercises that tests more than 5,000 troops. But this year takes on added significance as they'll also be testing the readiness of the German-led multinational battle group that forms part of NATO's enhanced forward presence. You can see now the operation of river crossing is being conducted by all the other participants of uh, uh, Iron Wolf exercise, that's 10 NATO countries, uh, so around 30 vehicles are crossing now the bridge that was being built uh, by German and United Kingdom uh, engineers. We've just seen a German-led bridge building exercise with Apaches flying overhead. But this is just one of a number of events that have taken place recently where the four multinational NATO battalions here in the east of the Alliance have been put on public display. It's quite important that we come together as 29 nations now uh, and have that capability to, uh, to deter, and if not deter, to fight and win on the battlefield uh, to ensure that our borders are long-standing and uh, our people are safe and, and they are free. Just seen the arrival of a number of distinguished visitors, including Lithuania's president, Dalia Gribalskaita, as well as Jens Stoltenberg, the NATO Secretary General. And the clear message here isn't just one of combat readiness, it's also of multinational togetherness.